Hello everyone, welcome to Tutorials Diary. In this video, I will show you how to install Ganesha blockchain on the Windows system. So before we really jump to installation phase, let's try to understand that why this is required. So think about an HTML application which you have developed that is currently running on your local system. So now you want to expose that application to outside world. So what you will do, you will take that application deploy on some application server. It can be any application server. So this is how you're going to expose your piece of code to an outside world. So same thing applies in the Ethereum blockchain as well. So whenever you do any development in Ethereum using any language like Solidity, you build a smart contract. So that smart contract has to be deployed somewhere. So we generally deployed that smart contract to blockchain. So that can be some test blockchain, that can be your Ethereum main blockchain. But if you are a beginner to Ethereum development, so we always recommend to have Ganesha installed on a local system so that you can play around with the development and you can learn from there. Okay, so now let's move to the installation step. What step you have to follow to install this on your local system. So first of all, as you can see, you have to go to this URL truffleframework.com slash Ganesha. So once you go here, you will see this link for Windows where you can go and click on download. So once you click on this one, it will start downloading for you. So I already downloaded one before, so I will just cancel this current download. I will just start installing from my previous download. I will click on this one, I will say run. It will take some time to start the installation. Okay, I will choose this option. Anyone can use, say next. I will say yes here. So I'm going to install on my C drive, click on install. Now it will start installing all the files. So let's wait for a few minutes and it will, it will complete the installation. Okay, now as you can see, the installation is completed. So now you can either check this checkbox or you can uncheck this one. Let's do a check only and say finish. And that will complete your installation and it will start the blockchain. It may take few seconds to open the blockchain. Let's wait for that. It is starting now. So now you can see it is starting, it is showing, it is starting the blockchain. And you can see the version is 1.1.0. So let's say continue here. So now this is how it will look like on Windows machine. So as you can see, here you will get by default 10 accounts so here you will see the blocks if you if you start using this one you will start to the account currently zero but as you go along you will start the development this block count will change and then transactions whenever you do